heard all this before. But I encourage you to listen to this entire message. Let me ask you a question. What would you be today if you had the opportunity to participate on the ground floor of the telecommunications industry? How about the regulation of energy? Or what if you were fortunate enough to be one of those lucky individuals who got a chance to invest in Microsoft? I can tell you this. You probably would not be listening to this message right now. If you were saying to yourself, I wish I had the chance to participate in an industry that would captivate the masses, your timing couldn't be better. I don't know if you know this. There is a $2.2 trillion industry that is peaking right before you. Some have heard of and others have no clue that one of the biggest wealth trends is happening right now, today. So what is that trend? The death of cable television. It is a known fact that 60% of consumers who are paying for cable TV are fed up with the high cable bills and never any rates or the daily. Bad customer service, which is now forcing consumers to look for other alternatives besides cable TV. If you were anyone can relate, then you have come to the right place. There is a well-recognized company that has been in business for over 15 years that has a product that can show anyone how to eliminate their monthly cable bill for good, which means you will be able to get the same services that cable TV provides, plus much more, such as live TV, live sports, over 100,000 TV shows and movies ever made. Also, you get live international channels. This product can even turn any TV into a smart TV, which is powerful. In business one on one, it states, in order to become wealthy, you have to find a problem that people are facing and provide a solution, which we have. But in reality, anybody can benefit from this powerful product. If you have it, can help. And before you think you know what our product is, know this is not some Amazon Fire Stick, which stops working only after a few months, which forces you to keep paying programming fees. This is not Apple TV or Roku or Google Chromecast, which all three of those have monthly fees. We have something that is way better and which is superior. It is like having your own personal red box on steroids. In conclusion, just like the deregulation of energy, we are educating consumers on how they can eliminate that dreadful cable bill for good. And in return, you can earn a nice residual income from home. Don't miss out. You'll be sorry you did. For more information, be back to the person who sent you to this call. And you have yourself a wonderful day. Welcome. 
Welcome, everybody. Welcome to the call. I think I heard Virgin Islands. We have people calling in from everywhere. We have one more minute. Welcome to the call. Welcome back to Biz Asia America. I'm Michelle McCorry. Comcast recently offered to buy Time Warner Cable for $45 billion. And it comes as cable providers are losing hundreds of thousands of customers every quarter. And many of those customers are turning to streaming content providers like Netflix, Amazon, and Hulu. Karina Huber explores whether the trend could mean lights out for the cable industry. The entire second season of the award-winning drama House of Cards just premiered on Netflix, all 13 episodes at once. By many measures, it was a success. Netflix doesn't provide viewing numbers, but an industry report shows roughly 15% of its U.S. subscribers watch the show. U.S. President Barack Obama even tweeted about it. Part of the appeal is you can watch the whole season in one shot. The whole phenomenon of binge viewing that has been talked about is uh, even more so this uh, year than last year. Welcome back. The roughly 5 million viewers who watched the new season may be small compared to a top-rated television show like American Idol, but Netflix's subscriber base is growing rapidly, while cable continues to lose viewers. I wouldn't say the death of cable is imminent anytime soon. However, over the long term, I think, I think it's a valid question as to the role of Internet television in potentially uh, replacing a chunk of viewership as we see in traditional linear television today. While American cable customers pay around 80 U.S. dollars a month for cable TV without broadband internet, a Netflix subscription costs just $10 a month. Netflix ended 2013 with 33.5 million members in the U.S. and another 11 million overseas for a total membership of 44 million. Even if linear television may be on the road to extinction, Cable companies are likely here for the long haul. That's because the majority of U.S. households rely on cable companies for high-speed access to the Internet. Whether you watch television or use the Internet, most Americans are still paying the cable company. Broadband currently accounts for the bulk of cable industry profits. Providers have been increasing their broadband prices, but analysts think prices may soon level off. Competition is going to force the cable broadband providers against, you know, the telcos and other providers to become more realistic, and perhaps you're going to see more pricing pressure over the longer term. Where broadband pricing is headed is anyone's guess, and Comcast's $45 billion acquisition of Time Warner Cable is raising more questions about broadband pricing. That is something regulators are going to have to consider very carefully as they mull over the deal. Karina Huber, CCTV, New York. Welcome. Welcome, Florida. Thank you. I don't know who you're calling from. I'm great. I'm from All right, Maryland. I'm just hearing all these games coming in. I'm so excited for tonight. Good evening, everybody. My name is Evelyn Serrano from Columbia, South Carolina, and you are on the V Stream TV live webinar and conference call. We are so excited to have each and every one of you on the call this evening. We have a lot of information to share in regards to our incredible state-of-the-art product and compensation plan, as well as some amazing testimonies. The company uh, was founded over 16 years ago by Mr. Bob Bremner and his sons, David and Blair, with the Health and Nutrition products. And they uh, launched um, V-Stream in February of 2015. I have personally been involved with uh, V-Stream for one year last month. And I tell you, from year to the, from one year to the next, I have enjoyed the ride. I'm telling you, I have met so many great people, and I've received so much support from the corporate office, from my upline leaders, Marsha Hadley and Desmond Hines, as well as my team. There's no lack of support. But most importantly, I have helped countless of individuals and families earn money and save money. How awesome is that? How many companies do you know of that put people first? I know one, V-Stream. So the question is, how much money are you looking to make monthly? $500, 
a thousand dollars, five thousand dollars, or more. Well, I tell you, it's achievable. And if you know at least three people who are looking to earn unlimited residual income and who are tired of paying costly cable and satellite bills, then you are on your way with Z-Stream. You are at the right place at the right time. So I'm going to encourage each and every one of you to grab a pen and paper and get ready to take copious notes because the speaker this evening, he's someone that I look up to. And I had the pleasure, uh, myself and my fiancé, of meeting him and his family and, and the staff at the um, convention this past December. Just a lovely group of people. They care about people and they care about the business. Um, this gentleman works tirelessly seven days a week to ensure that these stream is nothing less than stellar. And he's someone who cares about the company and he cares about the people in the business. He's just an amazing person. I really look up to him, and I'm honored and privileged to introduce the speaker for this evening, the Vice President of Marketing, Mr. Blair Bremner. Blair, can you hear me? I can hear you, Eva. Thank you so much for that great intro. That was just awesome. Bob and Sarah are a normal couple. They have normal kids, live in a normal house, and like most normal people, they would love to spend less money on their cable bill. But spending hundreds on cable is normal, right? Bob and Sarah do enjoy a lot of what cable has to offer. He loves watching games with his friends, she loves good romantic movies, and their kids enjoy cartoons. The problem is, it seems like every other month their cable rate goes up because of some added charge or hidden fee. Like a lot of normal people, Bob and Sarah have talked about canceling their cable many times over the years, but they've never had a good alternative to switch to, until recently when Bob's friend Brett told them about the VStream 2 media player he'd just purchased. Brett said as long as they had a reliable internet connection, the media player would allow them to get all their TV shows, movies, and sports for no monthly fee. For Bob, this sounded too good to be true. But his friend went on to explain that the VStream 2 simply connects to your TV and allows you to stream free media already on the internet straight to your TV. Like most normal people, for Bob and Sarah, seeing is believing. So, Brett invited them to come over and see his VStream 2 in action. They were amazed. Not only was it easy to set up, but Bob could watch all of his favorite sports programs and Sarah had more romantic movie options than she could watch in a lifetime. Sarah asked Brett about kids programming for the children to watch and he showed her the amazing Kids Zone section that even had some parental control options for added safety. Knowing that it would save them well over $1,000 a year on cable, Bob and Sarah assumed that the VStream 2 would be very expensive. However, Brett explained that the one-time cost of $399 to purchase the media player would give them over 250,000 movies and TV shows, over 50,000 global radio stations, live worldwide sporting events, and the latest HD movies, all with no commercials or pop-ups. And that price includes a V-Stream HD-powered antenna so they can continue to pick up all of their local TV stations. Plus, they could surf the web, download apps from Google Play like YouTube, Pandora, and Skype, play online gaming, and much, much more. For Bob and Sarah, the answer was obvious. They purchased a VStream 2 and canceled their cable right away. Bob and Sarah are still a normal couple. They still have normal kids and live in a normal house. But one thing has changed. The ever-increasing cable bill that used to be so normal never shows up anymore. To learn more about how you can start saving money like Bob and Sarah, get back with the person who directed you to this presentation. When Bob and Sarah purchased their VStream 2 Media Center, Brett earned a $200 commission. When Brett told Bob and Sarah they could be paid for showing their media center to other people, they wanted to know more about how that worked. Click on the next video to learn what they found out. VStream 2. It's not only the best alternative to cable, it's the new normal in TV programming.